I grew up in a farming community who we were passionate about agriculture. Being a farmer in Kenya, it is not easy because of global warming, lack of support from the government, and unreliable sources of energy. Fresh produce goes bad in a matter of hours, thus making refrigeration more critical to farmers as myself. I use solar freeze to store vegetables for longer periods and look for better markets with higher prices. I used to lose over 50% of produce due to post-harvest loss since lack of preservation meant that within three days, the produce will go to waste or be forced to sell at rock bottom prices. Solar freeze matters because it gives farmers a viable option. I'd like to begin by telling you the story of my grandmother. She's a smallholder farmer. She grows mostly vegetables like kills, tomatoes, and mangoes on a small plot of land down in Makweni, which is in eastern Kenya. My nana's livelihood is tied to what she grows and sells. But every season, almost half of what she grows goes to waste before it reaches the market. That's almost half of her income. Farmers across Africa don't have access to fridges that will preserve the food they grow. This is a problem for over 500 million smallholder farmers across Africa. Solar freeze preserves and increases income for smallholder farmers. We build and rent out solar powered fridges. It's sort of a sustainable Airbnb for vegetables. <laughs> Plus, we leverage on SMS and WhatsApp to text farmers with up to the minute market information so that they can earn a fair price for their harvest. Here is how it works for farmers like my Nana. After harvest, farmers deliver their food to a solar freeze cold storage. They rent out fridge space to store crates of produce, avoiding market glass. This matters. For example, the price of tomatoes can change by five times depending on the day of sale. So to take it a step further, we aggregate market information and text farmers about when they should sell their harvest and for how much. This way, they know they can get the best price for that crate of tomatoes. We are a non-profit. We can charge farmers an affordable price of four US cents per crate per day. We focus on the farmers in most need. To reach them, we partner with local co-ops. We are able to work with these farmers because they can access M-Pesa, which is like an East African version of Venmo. Our services have increased farmers' income by $2 million US dollars since we began our operations. We are also solving a climate issue, food waste. Food waste makes up to 6% of all greenhouse gas emissions. Plus, our fridges run on solar energy, a sustainable alternative to fuel-intensive diesel-generated fridges. I got an opportunity to study renewable energy at UC Davis. My parents expected me to stay in the US, but I decided to return home to solve the challenges I, I saw while growing up. I launched Solar Freeze with a team of engineers, agriculturalists, and renewable energy experts, as well as salespeople. Next up, we are raising 750,000 US dollars to expand into five new regions, namely Kenya, Uganda, Tanzania, DRC, and Ethiopia. We can improve the economic opportunities of farmers across Africa. It starts with cold storage. Join us in bringing prosperity to the farmers who feed us. Thank you.